Hello, my name is C, and today I have an unboxing for you. This time it is from Diamond Art Club. Um, it is a square kit, and we are actually looking at... Let's see. Um, well, that's upside down. Great start! <laughs> Tennessee River Sunset. I am never going to be able to get the full canvas here, so when we get to it, I will leave... A picture up. But let's crack into it. This is a square diamond painting. In the box we get toolkit, sticker, and the canvas. Whoop. I'm hitting stuff with the box. Cool. All right. Here is our little logbook sticker. Tennessee River Sunset by Abraham Hunter. Square diamond painting, 94 centimeters by 70 centimeters. So this is a big one. In our toolkit, we get, let's dump this out. Woo! Um, baggie full of baggies. You will most likely need more of these if you plan on kitting up in baggies. We get a pen with a matching squishy. This is actually a really nice green. Doesn't match the kit, but it's a nice color. <laughs> we have a pair of tweezers. They're super sharp. We have a couple of multi-placers. Our little pot of heart-shaped rocks. There's two of them in here. And we have our tray with a little stopper. It just clicks into place. We also get, these are fun extras that Diamond Art Club includes, they come completely random. The color of the pen is also random. But I got a little dolphin, confetti dolphin. You know, comes with a magnet on the back, you can use it as a cover minder. And the washi tape. I absolutely love this pattern. It won't work for this kit, in my mind. However, I, um... I think it is still very pretty. Let's crack this open and see what's inside. Well, I've ordered enough Diamond Art Club to know what's inside, but let's open it up. I also completely destroyed this bag. I do every single time. <laughs> uh, it goes this way. We'll get as much in screen as possible. All right. Oh, I have a love for reds, oranges, fall colors. It is still going, you guys. There we go. This is going to be absolutely beautiful. Okay. Yeah, we're never going to get this fully <laughs> in screen, but um, we will shuffle this over. This might be as good as we get. I'm okay with that. Totally okay with that. Cool. Okay. We have our bag of drills. This is Diamond Art Club's thank you pamphlet. It has what's included, tips and tricks, a coupon for your next purchase. I am a Diamond Art Club affiliate. Um, I do have a code, it is C10 for $10 off your first purchase if you have never purchased from Diamond Art Club before. Please do not feel like you need to use it. There are so many discount codes out there, just don't pay full price. Diamond Art Club does not want you to pay full price. There is discount codes in here, on the box, there is many other creators with codes. Alright, <laughs> back to the book. There is a link to the VIP Facebook group. Once you've, once you've made your first purchase, you can gain access to this group. It is full of super helpful tips and tricks, and you can see completed works there. Also, step-by-step -step instructions. And um, QR codes for their app uh, with another <laughs> discount code. Their app is actually super amazing. Um, as a Canadian, I find that their app works better than the website for me most of the times, especially when I'm um, 
on my laptop. For some reason, it doesn't work. The app does. Love it. All right. This is our sticker sheet. So you have Diamond Art Club at the top, the name of the kit, and the artist. Sorry, I blanked on the word there. Start and end dates. Here is a better view of that full picture. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at all the little pumpkins. Can you see them down here? No, it's not even in frame. <laughs> you have all your info about the kit. Diamond shape is a square, the size. Okay. <laughs> I like looking at the SKUs for these because you have DAC, which is Dar Diamond Art Club. I'm assuming. I like looking at patterns and trying to find things. I am probably so incredibly wrong. But you have DAC, which is Diamond Art Club. You have 2705. I'm assuming that's the number that this image is. So they made 2,705 images. Assuming. S for square. DTC, I do not know. But I'm going to figure it out one of these days. Anyways, enough about me being weird and nerdy. We have our ABs at the top. Anything below 150 is an AB. I have not seen Diamond Art Club go above 145, which is 145? 141, which is a white AB. We'll take a clo closer look at that when we get to those. But here we have all of our DMC numbers, symbols. There is 56 colors in this kit, and we also have two fairy dust. That's what they call them. Fairy dust drills. Um, we'll take a look at those when we get into the drills as well. Okay. So we'll do that now. First up. Say a farewell to this beautiful packing job and the lovely colors. I will never get it back in the bag like this. <laughs> On the bags. We have a little sticker that has the SKU number and the name of the kit. That way, if you store things separately, you can easily match it up. Um, I do store things separately when they are this large. <laughs> That's so true. I store things separately, so I rely on these stickers. Oh. Farewell, beautiful packing job. <laughs> Okay, this is going to be an absolutely massive kit, but look at all these reds! I am in love. Okay, I won't read out all the numbers, but I will if there's multiple bags. So first up, we have 666. I need the lighting to work with me today. It is very cloudy, so there's no natural sun. All right, so we have three bags, a 666. Some browns, an orange, lots of oranges, that's a pretty one, kind of like a pale orange. One, two, three bags of 498. Two bags of 742. We have four bags of 321. I absolutely love reds. This is making me so happy. Oh, okay. I'm thinking. <laughs> two bags of 433. One, two bags of 938. Three bags of 947. Pretty color. One, two, three bags of our 132. 132 is an AB drill. AB stands for Aurora Borealis. These drills have an iridescent coating on the top that kind of shimmer and shine. This one is giving off greens and pinks, but sometimes you can find even blues and purples. These are absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> oh, we lost one. Anyways, uh, two bags of 815, three bags of 721. I have no clue how I'm getting this back in the bag. 
I usually don't open up the bag unless I'm actually like working on it. So who knows? <laughs> All right. 141 is our next AB. Tiny handful of that. And these are just drills that have like small amounts of colors. Some brown, some more yellows. I am so sorry for bumping you again. <laughs> this is our first Fairy Dust Diamond Z166. So it is showing up really green in here. Let's see if we could take a look. Uh, you can kind of... I wish I would focus. Focus? Um, you can kind of see it. Not really. Um, the glitter on the top of the drill. It has a really pretty effect. I'm excited to work on a kit that has glitter drills. I haven't yet. A teeny tiny bag, a 310. That's wild. <laughs> I'm used... I gravitate toward kits with darker colors, so usually there's like three or four bags, a 310. Our next glitter is it drill. Glitter drill. Fairy dust. Z727. Guys, I'm losing the ability to speak, I think. Um, these are also... It's a very pale yellow. But it should also have some glitter on the top if my phone will focus. Let's see. Uh, you can't really see. It's a very subtle effect. Um, yeah. Very subtle glittery effect. But there we go. Okay. Um, how are we gonna do this? Anyways, we're gonna just pick these up and move them for now. One second. Woo! That's dealt with. Okay, we are looking for one dot, V, and then the little chevron looking chevron. I don't know what it's called. Okay, so first up, this is not going to go too well. Let's zoom you right on in. Okay, so we have that Z727, which is that pale yellow glitter. It is in here. Um, doing some highlighting in here. We also have all of those ones, which is the, our orange AB all in here. Some more of that glitter, some more ones. So plenty of ones in this kit. Plenty of places for it to go. I'm rolling this up the wrong way, but it's fine. Um, we have our white AB, which is right in the center of this. So like right in here. Along with more of that glitter. And of course, all of this orange is our AB. So the orange is just everywhere. Let's see if I can show you some more. Um, so like right in here, there's some more up here, some more in here. I will zoom back out to show you. It is even in um, the leaves in here. So we have some in the leaves on both sides. I didn't even do um, like a tour of the canvas. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> Um, we also have, stop falling, I don't have enough space, I think I need to change where I do this, the next time I do a massive kit like this, because, hoo oh boy, um, in here we have all of our V's, which is that green fairy dust, and then some more of that pale yellow, also the lamp has some of that orange AB, more of that orange down in here, and even in the pumpkins. So now we can take a look. I want to see the pumpkins. <laughs> so we have all of our pumpkins down in here. And they have some orange AB. Cool. Okay, let's center this. Again, let's zoom out. Ooh, too far. There we go. <laughs> Alright. We have... 
I think that's all I want to talk about. This is Tennessee River Sunset from Diamond Art Club and Abraham Hunter. I am thinking I will be working on this kit for Drills and Chills. And there's a second fall event that is on Facebook. I believe I will be doing this one. I do have seven other kits pulled out for Drills and Chills. <laughs> I think it might actually be nine. We'll see. I also am working on two massive ones. I really want to get to this one because I love all the oranges and the reds and I think it's beautiful. But do I want to start another 90 by 70, 90 by 70 kit? We'll see. Why don't you guys chime in? Should I work on this kit for drills and chills? It won't be the first one. It'll probably be like the second or third one. But should I work on this one for drills and chills? Let me know down below because I'm indecisive and will change my mind in 30 seconds. All right. If you like this video, please consider liking or subscribing. If you have any questions, comments for me or anything about this kit, please let me know down below. Um, why don't we go with, if you made it to like the very, very end, why don't you drop like a leaf in the comment below, like an orange or red leaf, and let me know what you think. Alright, thank you so much for watching, and have a great day everyone!